Pokémon! <laughs> so cool! I gotta touch it. Us. Rangers, go! Rosie Red, great power! Mandy. A specific kind of pollution that usually comes from large factories. It's really ugly! It's really poisonous, which means big trouble for our friend Max. He can't touch that stuff! Only you can stop him, Rangers. Rosie. Strength power. Pepper! Inviso power! Indigo. Speed power! Ready, Rangers? Rangers, ready! Flu, 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 flu! Ride, Rangers, ride! Touch the goo! It looks so cool! Back up! Take him! Whoa! You guys have flying scooters! Cool! I'm on a flying scooter! Time to go, Max! We'll see you again sometime. And in the meantime, don't try to touch strange things just because they look cool, okay? Never a good idea! Got it. Bye, Rainbow Rangers. Mom, the coolest thing just happened. Look, it's coming from that factory. And that's Preston Praxton's logo. We need to stop it. If we don't, it will poison plants and fish, even the ground. Grazing animals will get sick too. Two part plan. Indy, you and I build a dam, stop the sludge. Pepper, you go talk to Preston. Me? You've got the shimmer shawl. You can sneak in and get to Preston. We can't. But what do I say? Give him the uh, sick plants, fish, animals talk. That's good. Something sticky. 
caramels. Floof! Floof! <laughs> That's nothing. I've got a solid gold robot who cooks, cleans, and is right now rubbing my feet. Got one of those, Rupert? Ah! What in the name of humongous heaps of money? Um, hi, Mr. Praxton. A rainbow ranger? Who let you in? Sir, it's about the sludge you're dumping. Lies. But the sludge is real. Lies. And awful for the environment. Lies, lies, lies. Booby trap. Ha <laughs> ha. But I'm not really sure the dam was the best idea. Oh, I couldn't do it. Preston Praxton wouldn't listen. He... <gasps> Look! It's overflowing and the sludge is going everywhere! The dam won't do it! We need Preston to shut this down. And if he won't listen... We'll show him what he's doing. Come on, Rangers! Let me scope this out. Here's the plan. I move the pipe so the sludge flows up and into Preston's office. Then he'll get a taste of his own sludgy medicine. Bet that means lunch. We better stall Preston before he goes out. Good call. Let's go. Inviso power. Grace, tell them to start the helicopter. My tummy's rumbling. Ah, not so fast, Preston. When I booby trapped you before, that meant I wanted you out of my office. Can't you even fall properly? Now get down that trap! Just a few bends more! Last chance, Preston! Stop dumping the sludge! It's not sludge, just a little schmutz. Big stream, little schmutz. Won't make a difference. Now, tell your friends to fall. Uh, uh, he can't hold on much longer. Hurry up, Rosie. We're running out of time. On it. You should have helped when we asked, Preston. You're gurgling, Preston statue. Is your Tommy upset? Ah! What's that? Uh, we can't touch the sludge, Indigo. Uh. Come on. Help! Please help! It can't touch me. It's goopy. It stinks. It's it's. Oh, it's horrible! Yeah, it is. And if it's too horrible to touch, then it's too horrible for the stream, right? Make it stop! You first! You stop sludging, we stop sludging. Ah, deal! Heard her. I did it. Now, will you leave me alone? Will you clean up the stream like the sludge never happened? Ah, you rangers are so demanding. 
I need a crew of people to clean the slug out of my office. Grace, and another crew of people to clean the sludge out of the stream. Ahem. Uh -huh. Immediately. Mission accomplished, Rosie. Homeward bound. When trouble comes, we're on the way. Rainbow Ranger saves the day. Opposite of floating. Kalia needs us. Rangers, go! Rosie Ray, strength power! Ride Rangers, ride Rangers, ride Rangers, music power! With blue by their side, they use their And a banana! Animal power! They've got to help their friends on Earth. This Earth is worth a lot. Satellites are very important to the Earth. Carry the Earth's communications. Phone calls, TV, internet, GPS navigation, they all go through satellites. Exactly. And when pieces fall off that shuttle and become space junk, it puts the satellite in danger. We have to get out there and stop any more junk from coming off the shuttle and hitting that satellite. That's right. And I know just who to send. Rosie. Strength power. Baby. Vision power. Indigo! Speed power! Ready, Rangers? Rangers, Rangers ready! Flu, 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 flu! Ride, Rangers, ride! to hold you down, so... Ooh. Looks like we zapped to the right place. There's the space shuttle. No way! That's Preston Braxton's logo! Why is he in space? In a falling apart space shuttle? Let's find out! Ah, oh, the good life. The first private space shuttle soon to be available to everyone. But won't tickets be like a million dollars each? Available to everyone rich. Millionaires will pay millions. And since I paid rock bottom to build this thing, I'll make billions. Ew, what is that, Daddy? Ah! Rainbow Rangers! Even in outer space, those rotten little... Watch your mouth, Preston Praxton. BB tapped into your communication system. We can hear every word you say. Then hear this. Unless you have vast sums of money for a ticket, 
Get off my space shuttle! Your space shuttle's falling apart! Uh, is the shuttle really falling to bits, Daddy? Oh, please. The rangers are shaking it to scare us. We're fine. But I see sparks! Disco lights! You have to fly the shuttle home! It's too dangerous out here! Lies! My shuttle is the greatest, most cutting-edge spacecraft ever built. It's in perfect shape. No more talk! I'll push this back myself! <laughs> Sorry, Rosie. No gravity, no strength power. Seriously? Space is overrated. But we have scooter power. Yes! Let's give it a shot. Three, two, one, blast off! <laughs> All right, you win, but don't push me. Let me fly my own shuttle back so I don't look like a buffoon. Hmm. Okay, you can fly, but we can't help with the buffoon thing. Now take this junk bucket home, Preston. Aye, aye, Skipper. In five, four, three, two, one. Booby trap! Your sunscreen, Rangers. I hear the sun is toasty this time of year. The, the sun? sun? He shot the Rangers in the sun? It is chilly in space, right? It might be nice to warm up a little. But it's not like they'll actually hit the sun. They'll get out, right? Overfloating. Bye bye, Rangers. Now we go home, declare the trip a success, and watch the millionaires crawl over each other for tickets. What's happening? Just a bubble in the bibble. Uh, not to worry. Ah! Uh -huh. Uh, no prob. We're gonna crash like the rangers said. You gotta free the rangers. Only the rangers can save us. Stop saying rangers, young lady. Rangers, 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 rangers! No, no rangers. Ah, rangers, help! Now he needs our help. There's a secret way to get out. You just. I can't believe I want to hear more from Preston Praxton. Something went wrong. Rainbow TR advisor, go! It's not just them and us now. They're going to crash on Earth, and anyone near them is toast. <laughs> Poor Floof. Doesn't understand what's happening. Who puts a mirror in a booby trap anyway? A man who loves the sight of himself! Oh! It's not just a mirror, it's an emergency exit! Let's go! Oh boy! Nose just caught on fire! That means it's entering Earth's atmosphere with a friction heat. It means it's too hot to handle! No, it's not. Constructomax. Construct a heat shield. Now that the shuttle's in Earth's atmosphere, your strength power will work. I just have to get in front of the shuttle. Indy, lend me a little speed power. Love to. Take the scooter, Floof. <laughs> speed power! Daddy, please! Do something! Okay, Sugar Plum.
Oh, I missed you so much, Earth. I thought I'd never see you again. Please, please tell me you learned your lesson, Preston. Of course. I'm never going into space again. Until next month, when my new and improved space shuttle will be ready. Seriously? You're all invited for a ride, but oops, you can't afford it. Come, Patty. Thank you for saving us. When troubles come, we're on the way. Rainbow Rangers save the day. You're right, Pepper. The air pollution makes it difficult for everyone, humans too. And it makes the city seriously ugly. You can see the city needs your help, Rangers. You have to save the birds and get to the bottom of this pollution problem. Baby! Vision power! Indigo! Speed power! Lavender! Micro power! Ready, Rangers? Rangers ready! Flu, 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 flu! Ride, Rangers, ride! the chickadees. Vision power! I see them. Follow me. <laughs> Hop on, little friends. We're getting you out of here. I see a forest that way, outside the city. It'll be a good place for the chick. Speed power! Done! Now what? Now we find Preston Craxton and get him to clean up his mess. Baby, come on. Preston's bad, but you can't blame him for this. 
It's not like he's behind every bad thing that happens on Earth. That's Preston's company logo. And I see his logo on all the other buildings around here, too. Maybe he is behind every bad thing on Earth. So where do we find him? Easy. Vision power! Okay. I see a big construction site. Lots of pollution. And I see Preston. Let's ride! Looking good! This will be our skyscrapingest skyscraper yet! Ha ha ha! Preston Praxton, we need to talk to you! Ah! Well, well, well. The Rainbow Rangers. I wish I could say I smelled you coming, but honestly, I can't smell a thing! Ha ha ha! That's because of all the pollution! And your constriction is making it worse! Pollution? What are you talking about? This air is as pure as the seaside in summer. <sighs> ah. If the air is so clean, why are you wearing that gas mask? Gas mask? <laughs> this mask is couture. It came with the suit. You know we're right, Preston. This city is in danger. Ah. That is so rangers of you to say. <laughs> this city is an environmentalist dream and wonderful for many vacuum cleaners. See, not a speck of pollution. Flew. Oh, sooty. You should really get that thing checked out. Someone should get Preston's heart checked out. I think it's turned to sud as well. At least he hasn't pulled out a remote control and triggered a booby trap. Uh, I really wish you hadn't said that. <laughs> Why? It's not like just because Anna put it out there, Preston's gonna somehow cosmically realize he forgot and... Oh, wait. I just cosmically realized I forgot. Booby trap! <laughs> oh. Dumped in that cement, we'll be stuck in Preston's building forever! But I don't want to be a building! No! Constructo map, construct a safety net! Phew! Oh, good thinking, BB! Oh, for real! Cement shoes are so last year! You know what's weird? Fluffernutter sandwiches. Why put marshmallow and peanut butter together in a sandwich? It's just not logical. Aside from that, what's weird is that, except for those birds, we haven't seen one animal here. And there are no trees at all. If I could, I would cover every building with plants, basement to penthouse, just like I did in the cove. Lavender, that's it. We could create a vertical forest. A forest in the middle of the city. Yes! A vertical forest is a building with trees planted on the roof and balconies. That sounds splendiferous! It's more than that. It's exactly what'll heal this city from all the pollution. I don't understand. Plants are pretty, but how can they heal the city? Because plants take in air that's unhealthy for humans and give off healthy air that humans can breathe. First step, we need plants. There is a nursery full of plants for sale. But it would take forever to make enough trips there. So I guess we need a plan B. Or a plan B. Speed power! We'll need more, but that's a great start. Let's get planting, Rangers. We'll turn that skyscraper into a beautiful air cleaning machine. Woof! Wow! 
What's that? Hard to hear you through the gas mask. No, the place is like paradise. Gotta go, Willard. Something's going on. I sense something different in the air. Is that fresh air? I don't understand. What happened? We built you a vertical forest, Preston. Look! You can't improve my building behind my back! Too late. We already did. And it is improved, Preston. See how pretty? Hmm. It does look rather pretty with the trees. And you know what a pretty building brings. Fresh air, healthy lungs, happy wildlife. Floof, floof. A pretty penny! <laughs> it's true. People will want to live here because they'll actually be able to breathe. And easy breathing means I can charge so much more in rent. The forest stays. Yes! Look! The birds are back! When troubles come, we're on the way! Rainbow Rangers save the day! to a fire. It's very dangerous. Kalia, it looks like they're in a swamp. Is that possible? No way! A swamp is wet. Wet things can't burn. Bibi's right, Indy. It is swampland. It should be wet and lush and most certainly not on fire. So, why is it on fire? Guess that's what we gotta figure out. After we get rid of the fire, right? Exactly. You need to save the orangutans, put out the fire, and figure out why the swamp is dry and burning in the first place. Rosie. Strength power. Mandy. Music power. Pepper. Inviso power. Ready, Rangers? Rangers ready! Ride, Rangers, ride! I do. Rainbow Tiara Visor, go! 
I see them. This way. Up you go, baby. She's worried about her baby. She's gonna run through the flames. Someplace safer. Ride, Rangers! Ride! The fire almost looks pretty from so far away. Oh, pretty dangerous, Mandy. We need to put it out so no one gets hurt. What do you think, Firefighter Floof? Up for the job? Floof! Then let's do it! Make it happen, Floof! Look, Floof! understand how a wet swamp caught on fire in the first place. Well done, Floof. Mission accomplished. Come on, orangutans. All safe. Wait! No! What's wrong, Pepper? <laughs> Look! Seriously? Get it out, Floof. What happened is, this area is filled with peat, mushed down vegetation. It's very flammable. Even when it's wet? No, but there's lots of layers of it here. Floof just wet down the top layer. But the peat embers are still burning under the top layers. Exactly! And they'll keep making big fires until this whole area is soaked and fully swampy again. Ah! Sounds like Floof's gonna be pretty busy swamping up the place. I don't think so. They need way more water than Floof can make. So, how can they stop the swamp from burning up again? Floof can't keep putting out fires forever. How do we soak this place and put out all the embers? has to be water nearby. These are swamp plants. They wouldn't have grown in the first place if they weren't saturated with water. So we just have to find the water supply. Let's look. Or listen. If there's water flowing around here, I bet I'll be able to hear it. Sound power! I got it! There is water close by! Follow me! <laughs> Great job, Mandy! Hang on a second. I'm confused. Why? You wanted water? Mandy found water. Done and done. Let's start soaking the embers. Yes, but these are canals. Canals full of water. Again, all good. No, all bad. Canals just don't happen in nature. Someone built them. And look, they're leading the water away from the peatland. So. Someone dried out the peatland on purpose? I think so, but why? Not sure, but I think whoever it was left something behind. Look. What is it? I've read about vehicles like this. It's for logging, not just anyone's logging. Look. <gasps> Floof! Uh-huh. Preston Praxton's logo. Of course he's behind this. Oh, no! Where is he? Are we going to get booby-trapped? 
I don't think so. This thing is pretty rusty. Whatever Preston did here, he left it behind a long time ago. So now Preston's causing trouble with an abandoned business? Abandoned logging business! It all makes sense now! Yes, of course it does! It all makes sense now! <laughs> yes. I gotcha! Give me five! Um, how does it all make sense now? Loggers build canals that lead out of swamps so they can float away the trees they cut down. So that's what Preston did. He built canals to float trees away from the swamp. Yes, but the canals sent the water away from the swamps too. And that's why everything is dry and catching fire. So if we get rid of the canals, will the water go back to the swamp? I think so. But we don't have to get rid of the canals. We just have to dam them up so the water doesn't go into them anymore. Ready for some heavy lifting? <laughs> Can't wait. Strength power! Great work, Rosie. Now we just need to fill it in with sticks, mud, and rocks. On it! Got it! Floof, floof! About to find out. It worked! We yes! did it! Flip, flip! And look! The orangutans are back to enjoy their forest again! <laughs> Troubles come, we're on the way! Rainbow Rangers save the day!